Hey Pokemon nerds, Nerdstacular here, and this is my April update for the Pokemon 20th anniversary. So this month was Jirachi, and I was at Toys R Us, I think the, the day that they came in, which is apparently what you have to do if you want to have any luck. So I got the Jirachi Clip and Carry, and they had a ton of these at the Toys R Us that I go to, which is weird because, well maybe it's because they're finally catching on because with the other ones, these were coming in more towards the end of the month, and even then, they were like six and seven per store. My store got like 17 of these, and there were a ton of them. It's crazy. So we got the Clip and Carry, and I was able to snag the plush. Same deal as all the other ones. I don't need to take them out and show you, because you know what it is by now. It's that crushed velvet looking stuff. I'm not sure what this green stuff is under his eyes because to me it makes him look sad like he's been crying and his makeup is running. I don't know what it is. He looks sad in the plush form. And then yesterday I finally made it to my comic shop to pick up the mythical Pokemon collection Jirachi boxes and we got two and we're in one of the little pins here and here's the other pin. And then pulls of note. So I got like in the front of the box you get the little the promo card. I got the full art Pikachu from the Pokecune, the English version. And then I pulled a full art textured Zapdos. Pulls of note for my husband. In one pack, he got Gardevoir EX and then Charizard EX. Because that's just how he rolls, apparently, and it's kind of crap. But he has <laughs> decent luck with these with the the generations boosters and what's neat is we each got you know our own box and we got different uh packages it's a weird like ocd thing like even when i buy them in singles i can't get two of the same so it just worked out perfect that they pulled boxes that were totally different for us so that is what we got for april uh may is dark cry and i want to give a special thanks to Pokemon Shiny Lover for letting me know about ordering Darkrai in advance. I was able to order two of them, uh, one for me and one for my nephew. Now, whether or not we will actually get these from GameStop is sort of up in the air. I have had the situation before where something looks like you can pre-order it and you are able to pre-order it, but then when it comes around to shipping it, they either don't fulfill the entire order or they're just like, Whoops, that wasn't supposed to be able to happen. So we'll see if everybody gets what they have pre-ordered. Um, and it could also be that, you know, I ordered two and I may only get one because maybe they're going to be limiting it to one per order, even though they let me order two in the same basket. So hopefully I get the two because that's one of the like four that my nephew really wants. So hopefully we get a dark eye. And then I just wanted to remind everybody that May 18th, is when the Blastoise EX box comes out. That's the really big one for like, I wanna say $24.99. And you get the PVC figure in it, as well as I think four generations boosters and a promo card. So that is May 18th, guys. And yeah, that was it. It was a short month for Pokemon, but that's, that's everything. So, all right, well, Train on, nerds.